Hello everyone. Oh, I think it's actually starting with a cutscene. <laughs> Hello, I am Archie. I will be playing Chrono Arc tonight. And I will not skip this. Thank you for showing up, Lily. I will I think I will need a guide for this. I'm actually getting a little bit scared from from what you're saying. Is it like a difficult game? The Narc Save Heaven from Humanity. Alright, let me check. I think the game audio is a little bit low. It's, it's alright. What's the worst that can happen, right? I've played all the Dark Souls games. I've played Darkest Dungeon. Yeah, I can handle this. One watch the game because of me since we're getting clear left and right. Who knows? Maybe I get some beginner's luck, huh? However, did you not realize? That I just like me, trying to make history. The Texans is having the occasion of Pills 2430. Oh, it's that hard? <laughs> Yikes. I kinda like roguelite games, but I am not the best of the, at them. I did play a lot of Binding of Isaac, got a lot of endings. And a lot of Risk of Rain too. I'm pretty sure I finished Risk of Rain 1 with all the characters. I still gotta play Risk of Rain 2 after the last update. Ooh, okay, let's give it a start. I think the audio is good. If it's too low, just tell me and I will raise it. I think it's around. Yep. Okay, so. I've seen glimpses of this game here and there. And but the music can get loud, so I get not to drop. Okay, perfect. So, I've seen glimpses of this game here and there on some streams, but I don't have any idea how it actually works, so let's find out. Um, okay, a slot, yep. Oh, that was a high note. Oh, it's early access? Cool. Welcome to the island. Mm, I doubt that. Yeah, yeah I think it's very ass is like 1.99999, so it's pretty close. This is the word everyone wanted. Come on, tell me. What do you desire? Oh. Gosh, that's a hard question. There's so much things that I want. I want a burger, but I don't think I can get it right now. Oh, look at that thing! That's so cute! Out right away! Wait. Just a little guy! It's like a, a porcupine, is that how the thing's called in English? I can run. No attack button seems, but I can jump. The jump doesn't seem very high, but it's okay. Hey, Yoku, how are you doing? We find our edge hard, you can tell. Oh! What, what did I press? Hold up. Tab? This was... What's this? Brazil? Okay, let me... Oh, these are characters. Ooh. I like this. Alright, so... Let me, f let me check how it works. Um, there's a lot of stuff here. I think I'm gonna just... Equipment, Relic... I think I'm gonna just wait to see how... What the game teaches me. Bloody Park, Misty Garden, White Raven Mansion, these are areas. Yeah, okay. Let's press them into the gacha characters. It, is it a gacha game actually? Because I kind of like the games where you collect stuff, collect characters. So I might like this. Oh, I can click to move too. Alright. Our character doesn't seem very interested to. Not a gacha doll, just unlock characters. Um, are they unlocked characters like 
you keep 10 between runs or do you lose 10 each run? It's a rogue light or you 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 start completely from zero. Lucy, that's her name. Azar. <laughs> you know, oh, the music actually gets loud. Hold up, let me lower it a bit. There we go. I think I should lower the music a bit more later. Um, fun fact: Azar means bad luck in Portuguese. I don't probably a coincidence, but. Joey, you're always too slow. Wait, it's like just a child, right? You're always too slow, kid. Leon, oh, I like her. She liked her red riding. Wait, yeah, red riding hood, whatever it's called. The child, don't be hard on her. Oh, she's go high. Hold up. Slave Knight Gael, look at that. Slave Knight Gael, if he was a wife, not the. That the male Gael was the wife, but you know, slightly, slightly lesser booba, but still. Yeah, no problem. Don't push yourself too hard, because you're the treasure of the investigation team. <laughs> okay, let me wait, 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 wait. Um, overall sound volume. What if I do? Oh, now it gets too low, I think. Um, let me see. Okay, I think it's better now. We'll see, I will adjust depending on how it's going. Let me get it here. So, all right, we'll see. Wait, are the sh the shrubberies square? Interact with E. Okay. Wait, this is me. I'm not scared as long as everyone's here. Wait. This is me, but I have something around my neck. I don't like where this is going. Ghost childs with like stuff around their necks usually means you know what let's just keep going. Can I talk with him? You take care of my monsters, just lead the way for us. We'll protect you, don't worry. Chooses a great sword? Cool, that's so nice. I don't know you have any problems. Alright, we just keep going? Yeah, I guess so. Oh, now it's getting dark. Are you gonna have problems here? Oh no! They're actually instant kino. Yeah, yeah, I know, right? Strand user? Yeah, that's gonna be my favorite character. Hey kid, come here and eat this. Freshly cooked. Stay warm, Lucy. Wow, so warm! After collecting the last piece, we'll head to the clock tower. Our journey ends not far off. The clock tower is what we see on the main menu, right? Okay. All thanks to Lucy. <laughs> I'll give you some credit. They're going for the clock tower to have some fun. This is supposed to be like the perfect world, right? So I don't know if I want to know what's in the clock tower. Don't put your guard down until it's over. We almost there. Time to restore the world. Oh, so we're trying to probably we're trying to like redo stuff. Maybe it's a bastion scenario. We'll see. Hold on. <laughs> Take lock tower. See, no one here has a gun, right? That's why they're going up there. They're gonna get some guns and take care of whatever they have to. You just a kid until we get the clock tower. Thank you so much. Can I eat? No? Okay. No one's like... They're all ignoring me. I do feel this is like an after... Life after death or something. Oh, am I static? Oh! Ah, it's an enemy face. Okay. 
I got really scared for a second. Is... Is this a horror game in disguise? Oh. I was just caught a little off guard. So we can't like this. Joe is no longer moving. Oof. No! Not Leon! I'm afraid. This is my end. Lucy, run as far as you can. Leon's no longer moving. No, what's... As I? Just a little bit. If I don't a little bit better. Could have opened the way to the clock tower. Oh no. Oh, test me. Oh, I like seeing kids crying. No. How did this happen? Please, everybody, wake up. I don't care what happens to the clock tower anymore. So please. Oh no. Well, Shadow's dead. I can't experience a death in experience it. I'm not gonna lie, the game is a lot darker than I thought it was Don't worry, this is not good. It's just another beginning. Because you are the hero of this world. This is interesting. Oh, there you go. I'm waking up. Ash and dust. Okay, same stuff as before. Let's just take a look around. Giant bear! So cool! Why my ass did I slap? Cat outfit? Why can't I? Lily, how do I get a cat outfit? This is crucial information. I need this as soon as possible. In game currency, two hundred thirty-five hundred. Okay, okay. I go. I know what I'm gonna save for then. I know what I'm gonna save for. Wait, there was something to interact at. I am not down bad. I think cats are cute. Shut up. I have a cat. She's cute. Yeah, maybe. Oh, it's gonna take a while then. I, 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 I can do some free time. Not like I need to like study or do video editing on my free time. Or just. Keep doing runs. Are you sure? Despite what I said yesterday, there's no need to hurry. It's better to be truly prepared. On that note, how about pressing the training grounds? Yep, let me see how the combat works. It's turn based, I think, to just sell some organs. Yeah, yeah, fair point. You, I don't need like two kidneys, right? Yeah, I don't think I need two. Like, sure one is enough. Is that a... Oh, it's a phoenix! I thought it was a chicken! I'm your temporary instructor. The one and only phoenix. Can't hurt my throat, sorry. Oh no, no, what's happening? Did I... Did I skip something? Alright, wait, I think I understand this. I gotta select the skill. This is my hand, so it's like a card game. Now the greater damage of first critical hit. They're roughly the same, so. Yeah. And. Can I just. Oh, I see, I see, I skip some lines of the tutorial. Yeah, I pressed the button by accident, I skipped it. But I think I get how the. How the turn works. This is like. It's like Hearthstone, but. The number of skills remaining. Okay. They even draw two. Is there not a log of stuff to see? Usually, visual novels have those text logs. Ah, but it's okay. I'm pretty sure I can handle it. Draw two skills and regain all your mana. 
All right, there's no more skills to redact the cards shuffled and added back. Since an ally is hurt, you try using the basic skill build. All right, critical hit at minus 10%. Not the All right, I get it. It's not the option we could use is here. This option we should use the exchange feature to discard the skill for the end of the from the deck. To basically use the draw. Mm -hmm, draw two cards. There we go. Oh, this reminds me a lot of Slate Aspire and Ring of Pain. I like it so far. Why does basic attack cost two when the others cost one? Good question. Because of overload. For every stack of overload on an ally, the skill costs are increased by one for that turn. Basically, you use to overload your ally, which causes the skills cost to increase. Okay, I did a bunch of skills in your hand. So, if I heal someone or do something that. Oh, I think I, I kind of understand this. Let me see, seal. I got 4 mana, so is there anything that I can use to like weaken it? Maybe take more damage? No, let's just combo attack. Wait, let me read the skill first. If I don't read, I feel I'm gonna. You already cast the skill this turn, I see. Alright. I think I understand how this works. Allies gain overload by ca casting skills, and overload causes your skills cost to increase. So, so since every player's skill, the overloads removed at the start of the next turn. Alright. Don't worry, there's some skills that don't cause overload. How do I know when they cause overload? Let me read this. So, I mean, the queen gives you two mana and a couple of skills. So, I have blue gems instead of. Oh! Sweetness is the skills not overload cards no matter how much you use them. Alright, so let me think. Illusion sword excludes those cards. Wait, so this costs zero, can I just... Oh, I see. Which skill play will reduce? Okay, I think I got it. Good job, isn't it fun to spend skills without worrying about overload? Besides swiftness, there are many other keywords that offer unique effects, so make sure to check them out. What happens for other skills in your hand? In that case, you can try to use the fixed ability. Look at the bottom, should be an excellent shaped skill. This one? I find a skill to your hand. It's a one skill you can only use once per battle. Zero to any use increase morale. And two mana, okay. I want to bring it to the bottom. Oh, I see, so characters also have skills. Okay, it costs one and only fixability can be used for a turn. You want to have a skill available at all times, you can do set of fixability. Wait for it passing the turn. Okay, if it's telling me to pass, I will pass. Oh, what's this? I should have a grasp how to use the skills by now. Then it's review time. Change the deck and add a couple of skills to your hand. Exchange world sweetness. Fight the knowledge you learned so far and do as much damage as possible. What is this? Burner flies. Let me see what I can do first. We will ignore town. Sweetness ignoring the action. Reload. Finish if I work with burn. Duplicate all illusions words in hand. I only have. I don't actually have any illusions words. I don't think this counts. What's the info should do? Good idea. 
if I can. Excellent shot. Alright, hold up, let me read for a bit. Deal damage to seven for each sword emotion sword buff in your hand. So if I use this, I'm gonna have a lot of then I'm gonna accelerate. Okay, I see how this works. So now let me Alright. Illusion. Back and zoom. What is it do again? Damage across the critical hit. Reduce. You move on second of taking damage. Oh I see. Lowers the defense. Nice. I should have used this first then. Oh. Why are they hot? Perfect, as they say, a great teacher makes a great student, don't you think? There should be no wishes with attacking, but... The problem is defending. The enemies won't just stand still and take your hits. On that note, I'll teach you how to minimize damage for enemy attacks. Attention count. Um, well, seeing is believing. Try some skills and pay attention to the action count. Where is it? Here? No, here. 3 and 2, so what if I use... Alright, now basic attack. Then we moved even though you didn't end your turn. Well, that's obvious. I said, the enemies won't just stand still and take your death. Oh, I think I understand this. Hold up. That means whenever I cast something, the numbers will go down. And if they reach zero, they're gonna attack me. Said it? Try to attack me in the middle of your turn. For the check the enemies to see. When they act. Mm -hmm. Alright, when you turn our enemies to remain action counts to act. But then see the action counts are going down. I'll give you all we all we skills and accelerate skills to try near damage by the Okay, the enemy didn't change, you understand how action works. Ooh. It turned green by the amount which Peter was lost. It's called the Healing Gauge. Try using this heal skill on any party member. Ow! Well, let's try again. Maybe... Yeah, I gotta beat this guy. <gasps> Is the Phoenix trying to kill me? He told me to use the thing and as soon as I used it, the guy attacked me. Holy shush. Let's look at the health bars again. You can see the healing gouges are somewhat gone. Let's try the health a bit. Let's try again. Oh, so I have a limit of how much I can heal in battle. I see. The fact what I remember no healing out recovered only a bit health. We have healing out like two wounds. If you treat the wound before it becomes serious, it can make a full recovery. However, if you get wounded again to the same spot, it will be difficult to heal, right? And very painful, yes. It's a good idea to heal your allies quickly so they don't lose healing out. Remaining healing out is filled up when the battle ends, so we can avoid the end of time. Okay. So if I lose the gray bar, it's gone for good. There might be ways to recover it, but for now, let's, let's think it has been gone for good. I press the end turn button. Okay. Did you pain damage? What? Not good for healing damage. 
I've given a pain debuff to a party member with the description to the buff for casting skill. 5 damage if you cast one of your skills. So if we use this. Oh, I see. This like punishes me for. Alright, I see. See what I mean? The healing gauge didn't disappear after taking damage. Most pain damage caused by spain debuffs. There are many debuffs to watch for besides the broken debuff. You can turn the tide by the color of the icon. There are some that instantly wipe your party if you don't pay attention. What? Sorry, sir, I cannot read. This is gonna be. I don't think I'm ready for this. Stay calm and read the description. Now, shall we go with the final turn? Press the enter button. The final turn? They have a lot of HP, I don't think this is the final one. And for the final stretch, Simon Tissue about standby. Still means action, count out, and skill. Final Fantasy is 14. Forget the debuff you don't recognize over because you read what it does. Okay, fine. I can't just like stay still and hope a healer pulls me. That works in Final Fantasy, I'm not sure if it's gonna work here. Then again, it's turn base, I don't think it's gonna work. Yeah, we're second top left. Stand by to reduce all many matches count by one and allow them to act first. Using stand by reduce everyone like okay. Okay, can use this mechanic, but there are many applications. For example, we can create opportunities to heal in between enemy attacks. This is interesting actually. Welcome coming here, so make sure to remember it. Time for the basics, not enough to teach, so. Are we gonna fight for real now? I'm challenge when in for cow mine. The most important thing is to never give up. Never give up! No matter the bad circ circ circumcisions? No. Circumstances. Yeah, the bad circumstances. Don't panic and apply what you learn to lead yourself to victory. Why are we being led by a child though? Sounds a little bit counterproductive this whole thing, but. Um, can I recruit? Okay. So you are a healer, strong fate as priestess, so she joined the investigation team to help purify the twisted land. But when we turn second to Renos because we can grow it. Okay, so we're gonna go for her, and what does this guy use? War her harbors immense hatred. Pharos. He's difficult to control due to his madness, but has great potential. Oh, it's just the edge boy. Let's see, this is another healer. Iron Heart. It's a leader in private. Okay, do you want to pick whoever you want or do you want some su suggestions? Okay, I, I would like some suggestions. So, yes, first of all. Like, when it comes to team composition. Is a healer always necessary? Or can I focus on, like... There are some roguelites out there that healing is kind of a waste of time. You're usually must, you're usually better just killing the enemy faster. Is this one of these games or should I pick a healer with me? You want a healer, okay. I think you're gonna go with Prezzo. So, one. Fourth year of the game now. Do I want a attacker or a tank? A DPS or a tank, which should I pick? When she cast a skill or fix the ability. Oh, okay. Either two DPS or DPS and the healer. Okay, so let's... We've seen what this guy do. So, let's go over this guy. Whenever he defeats an enemy, cast again half damage to another enemy. Oh, okay, so this guy is to deal with hordes. Has cleave mechanic. You kill something, you can... Attack again. Let me pick him to see how he does. See your favorite DPS. Is it? Let's be honest here. Is it because he's an edge boy? Is that why he's your favorite? I mean, I don't blame you. I, he's kind of cool, but let me see. Confirm. Oh, I'm already walking here. Hey, you're walking here. Press is my favorite healer. Nice. Good taste, good taste. Love everything about his design. His design reminds me a bit of like 
Attack on Titan design. The brown coat, the... The, like, thin sword. Oh, they have resistances. Very secret of chance. Fade. Oh, this character difficulty. Ooh. So the skills. What the hell is this? Alright, no items right now, so let's just... Let's keep going and see what happens. Um, what do I... Oh, here. One moment, sorry. Had to hydrate for a while, and I think I have an inventory now. Key... Bread... Yeah, we got that bread! And Lucy's necklace is going to fill with very fainted ally. Okay, fine. This is a hex scroll! So let me go... Can I interact with the square shrubberies? No. Sag. Charge! Oh, I didn't see, but you used the key, right? Alright, Axe of Rage and Cross Brooch. More armor, more critical chance. What's the base critical chance? Because I seen some some weapons being like minus ten percent and minus five percent. But what's like the basic ch critical chance? Ten, twenty. I don't know exactly how criticals work here. Depends on character to character. We won't take the X because it has negative speed. Which is really, really bad. Oh, let me check something first then. Let me go here. Card draw, increase max mana. No, no, no. What I want... Oh, the, the menu changed. Stats, attack, and power, armor, accuracy, bait, quick, quick, resist. What is the speed, by the way? I'm not... I may be blind, but I'm not finding it here. Speed is for your whole party. Oh, oh, I, can't. I see. Enemy action count increases with speed. Whenever you cast a skill, enemy action count decreases and you attack at zero. Basically, means how many action points enemy have. Oh, I see. So the more, the better. The more speed, the more you can attack without worrying about the enemies attacking. I see. Mana and card draw are obvious choices. What, I what about you? Have to basically heal me. Yeah, okay, that makes sense. Always good to have a heal as a fixed ability. Oh, I see a fight. What are we gonna fight? No! Wait. Wait. Wait, wait, wait. Do we have to. We have to fight the hedgehog? So each character has a critical chance to cast every individual critical hit chances. Oh, I see. I'm gonna check what the critical chances are later. Do I, do I really have to do this? I don't want to. Let's just take up the stone, I'm sure. Can I... Can I talk? Can't we... I don't know. Maybe... No, that's nice. Yeah, I gotta enter anyway. Oh, that thing does a lot of damage, actually. I did not expect this. No, 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 no. That's not what I want. I am stupid. Hold up. Watch this. I don't want to kill. It's kind of cute, but it's doing a lot of damage, and I don't like this. I'm sorry. Gold and soulstone. Used to upgrade levels and max mana. Characters information about them. Okay. 
go here. Level up spending soul stones. Can you write the random skill select? I imagine this gets reset every time I I go back, right? Every time I die. Will the max mana and card draw also reset? Or, or should I focus on upgrading these two first? Yes, they will reset? Okay. What, what's more important here? Would it be the levels or the the mana, the card rolls and stuff? I imagine the more card rolls, the better, right? You level your DPS first. Okay, so here. This guy has the madness. Alright, let's see what I have here. Blood Reflux. Restart the target ceiling gauge, but receive pain damage equal to half the amount. Don't activate to get level 2. Oh, I see! I thought it was innate of them. So, first thing I should do, I think, is get everyone to level 2 to unlock the passives. So, this is a heal that damages me. Attack power and healing increases based on lost health. This is interesting. Where is this explosion? Cannot be used to death store. It will take mutilate. Let me see what the other ones do. This one. Receive pain damage equal to 50% of your max HP. And deal twice the amount. Oh, I see, I see. This damages me to damage the enemy, I get it. And mutilate will... It's just a lot of damage to a random enemy. Okay. Let's increase you. Okay. Yeah, but don't worry. I wanna... I don't have any more soul stones. Oh, it's okay. Do I have to equip these cards or... Oh, I have a limit of how many skills. Probably his name Tear Up and Assault Slash. Alright, I'll keep my eye for them. Oh, I have to equip this here. Can I unequip the items if I equip them on the wrong character? Like, if I equip the cross on hind... Okay, hind. Let's equip it on hind then. There we go. Oh, this is the ability thing. Nah. Let's skip the end of the line. When target's health or yours is below 40%. So, hind is the high risk, high reward character. I see. This is cool. I can equip weapons have a curse on it. Will I know if the weapon has a curse, or do I only see it when I equip it? Alright, let's, let's see this place. Before another hedgehog shows up. I imagine... This is probably gonna take me to another map, right? Is it worth it to, like, explore the entire map? Or should I just look for the action as soon as possible? She do walk pretty fast, so. Oh, that's another one. Wait, I don't think this is the exit. I map for doing the boss. Wait, the boss? We're gonna fight a boss here? Table! Oh! -ho -ho. I see why I like this guy now. Hand her tools, vines, whatever, get out of combat. Okay. I can get keys. Cool. More soul stones. So this time we raise her. Mm, one of two random skills here that I can route. Quick prophecy, prioritizing attack skills. So this is a draw. Gang in our town and tracking. I see. And the pain weakening successors increase by 20. I imagine this is better when I get more cards that focus on weakening and pain, right? I don't have any of those here, so I don't think this is worth it. Let's see room over window on the buff. Looks interesting and make a prophecy prioritize to cast her skills. If you feed an enemy to their own skill, make another prophecy. <laughs> well, nice to know that the game is throwing me the bad cards. So, I imagine God's Blessing is not a useful thing right now. And this is very situational because Crassel is a healer, so I imagine most of her skills are gonna be involved with healing. 
and maybe I can. I'm not sure if this game allows you for like building for damage, but I don't think it's worth it. That's gonna be good if I can be clan kids early on. Yeah, let's take the purifying barrier then, because it seems like the most straightforward out of all of them. Should I? No, let's not fix it. I think it's good here. All right, let me go interact with the things. Oh, which is safe. So these are occasions that I can like choose what happens. Can you run on potions? And it's like once you want to upgrade it, counter loses far maximum health. We don't have a lot of maximum health early on. How powerful are the upgraded skills? I think like very powerful or the witch is safe. I intend to wait for the witch is safe. This is my first one, I don't think the uh, event tiles in those maps. As violence covered buildings that shoot into if the event tiles, I see. So it's a good idea to use them whenever possible. The upgrades can be good. I'm gonna go for the witch because, yeah, I like the team here. I think it's good. A witch is safe, radiating and nominal power. You can feel a powerful voice from within. Ooh, can I see? Let me, let me check something. What's in card does? For seven target another ally, heal yourself. Yeah, okay. Oh. Uh -huh. Critical chance, draw one skill. Does this mean that if I pick this, that advances will help? Yeah, I know the set. That's, I think that's a, a really cool mechanic. So if I'm getting this correctly, if I pick this upgrade with draw one skill, the required mana is going to increase by two. Is that it? No? Huh. Oh, it's a minimum of, of card for the mana, right? Think that the buffs only possible cards have. Oh, I see, I see. So. I don't understand exactly how this works, but I think it only affects cards that have the prophecy. So I'm gonna pick this one. But it does maybe. Go hit chance plus 50%. That's a lot. I will go for a critical chance, I think. Mm, yeah, yeah, let's go for a critical chance. I don't have a lot of mana, I'm just go gonna drown myself in cards and not be able to use them for anything. Which is a problem that I kind of ran into when playing Slate Aspire. I ended up having a lot of cards, especially when I did like. Uh, dagger builds, shield builds for the silent, but I had no energy to actually cast them. So here, quick a chance. Yep. Now let me check something. House with late, mostly plus. Oh, I cannot fix it. Okay. Oh, I see. My basic critical chance is thirty-one percent. Oh, I see. It's it's addictive. So if the mutilate has plus fifty and my base is thirty one, my total is eighty one. Perfect. I like this. This can lead to shenanigans. As the skills were is up, was upgraded, a strange smoke suddenly seeped out of the safe. I hurriedly blocked my mouth, but it was too late. All right. How much health does he have? 23. He's, he has as much health as our healer, so it's fine. Let's go back to the other line and see what's there. Oh, I see these items are usable in battle. Is using, are using items gonna lower the, the action thing for the enemies? Or 6 more damage, just as a reward, one skill book. Oh, here the cursed equipment and the Lucy Curse Q. 
I am curious to see what a cursed item is. Our three cursed skills are most always terrible. Well, we're kinda early, so we might as well see what it is early than like then get screwed up later on, right? Then again, let's see how far I can do on this run. Then I'm gonna experiment later. So it's a small amount of damage to the reward. Yeah. Look for a key or investigate a garden. Um Okay, first of all, what are the skill books? Do they unlock more skills or do they win so bad? There's a lot of potential per fight brilliant. Okay, I see. I get next time I run into one of those, I'm gonna perf I see. A level of opportunity. Oh I see. Let me try something there. Hold up. Let me just hydrate. For the sake of experimentation, I'm gonna investigate the garden. I'll like take six damage. And I got a skill book. It's like when you level up, you get three card choices. Like that, but no level up. Oh, I see, I see. So, let me use this. Ooh, Binking Hill and another Moot Lake. Nice! I got both of them. No, I, I only get to choose. Oops. And I got just another mood later. It, it's okay, it's okay. It happens. That's all learned. It's alright. Oh, it stays here. Cool. Alright, let's keep going. I can run! Nice! I didn't see that. Oh. Okay, I imagine this is where. Consistency is really good in this game. Okay, that's the boss. Next stage. You should prepare for engage boss battles. Nope, not gonna go there. It's not the time yet. This is really giving me its latest fire vibes when it comes to combat. Or Ring of Pain. I don't think you I'm not sure if you ever played that. But Ring of Pain was pretty much about consistency and stuff. I have to mention points, points of interest. Okay, I see. Sorry, tutorial, but. You can never but you can... Oh, I see. Unfortunately, Lily already told me how this works, so. There is no need for you. How much this recovers? 20%? Mm, but on the campfire is gonna be more useful. It's alright, I'm sure I sure can handle a boss. Kerberus! Making a prophecy. Okay, that's your ass. Ow! Nine plus, okay. Here? And I don't actually have any more. So what if I switch? It's gonna... Nope. Bad idea. Ow! Oh, he dodged! Nice! No. Let's go full attack now. I don't have any debuffs. The target or... Actually, let me check something. What if I... Okay. No debuffs, so let me switch this. Mutilate plus. Oh, nice. Now, do I heal him? Yeah, let's. No, 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 let's not heal. Let's give him another attack. Ooh. I don't. I'm not gonna need this. Easy. Was it supposed to be a hard game? I'm sorry, but. So far, so easy. Oh, that's a lot of loot. Unknown. Money, soul stones. Token of protection. Credits. Oh, credits are the thing that I use to... <laughs> I need to jump cuts to you wipe it. That's not gonna happen, you'll see. Golden skill. Golden skill? That's a lot of stuff, hold up. 
so it is an equipment let hang already has one equipment let me equip this one on presso because that's gonna that's gonna increase the armor right and she's gonna take less damage and Hein doesn't doesn't want to take less damage because you know he wants to be on low HP so maybe I should increase my mana now I go to the door and direct the object there all right give me one second I'm gonna use the golden skill book can't use this Oh, it's a shame that the boss didn't drop any scroll for us. I'm sure it would be very helpful. Let's keep going. Oh, campfires! So I have to revive fallen allies. You can consume items inside the campfire, bread will heal all allies. I just can't do campfire, so I find one for next. Okay, so. There you go. I can play this with just my mouse, that's good. Look at this, she's so cute! I love her! Why don't you try being a bit more friendly, hein? I never thought I'd hear that from you. They have banters! Banter, so cool! So, can I use only one of these or can I do all three of these options? If this is like the rest stops on the latest fire, all of them? Perfect. So, let's just. I don't think I need to use the campfire items since everyone's at full health. Correct? Yeah. Everyone full health, let's recruit someone. So I got one of these. Are tanks necessary or should I just go full DPS? This is always mechanics kinda cool. I like these mechanics where you like stack a lot of stuff and do a lot of damage. Your bad memory can be a recall six of excess skilling. I think we'll go with two DPSs. It depends. I imagine you need like to have a specific build in mind for them. I'm gonna go for Azai because I like him. Hope you're right getting more DPS, I think would be nice. We very much recommended Azai right now. Yeah, let's go with Azai. Confirmed. And is he not here? Oh he's gonna show up later, I think. Oh, I can combine items and then reforge them. I see. So, for example, I could pick the thing here. Oh. Alright, but I don't think I want to do this right now. Let's not reforge. Campfire item. Well, I don't think anything here is a campfire item except the bread, but... Wait, if I use the bread here, is the bread gonna like be consumed right now or is it gonna be like upgraded for later? Because the campfire kinda like heals up your HP, right? So it seems a bit redundant to have bread. You would eat it, so don't need to do it right now. Okay, fine. Let, we're done. Is that right here? There's my boy. We have another. Soulstone? No. So yeah, yes, let's wait for Soulstone to level as I now. I'm bored. Wait for set. Using the book, where is power of display stand? Alright, book. I can save between runs? Oh no, I'm stupid, it just <laughs> Sorry, sorry. For one moment I forgot how roguelites work. Let's go for your people. Alright, I see, but let me just check what this is first. Um, place relics. I don't have any relic, right? Nope. In this case, let's use this. Bloody Revenge. Level 96 damage compared to bonus damage for the skill. We're gonna see 46. This looks good. Let me see. What are the cards that you recommended me again? Let me take a look up here. Um, what's this one of them? Fantasy Savior Restaurant, what's it do? It's 
discard all zero cost skills from hand, draw one more than the discarded amount of the deck. It costs zero and gains swiftness. Oh, this might be good with with Azar, right? Because Azar has a lot of zero with the illusions worth things. I don't think it is any zero cost. I see. Perfect. Let me pick it up. Let me just reboot this. Those. Make a prophecy whenever you draw after exchanging a skill. Alright, we pick fantasy. It's his skill, okay. Can I. I can't fix it. It's okay. Can I fix this? Yeah, let's fix this. Let's keep going then. Oops. <laughs> the music's fun, I like this. If it's not showing on the map, I don't think I have to worry about anything, right? Gold? Well, that's that was easy. What about this? Al Alchemist House, obtain one random potion. Use a key to obtain one more random potion. And an uncommon tire equipment. Nice, I have two keys. Your random skills from investigators were not in your party. And pay a scroll to learn one skill. I don't have scroll, so it's not gonna be useful. That's Visit Alchemist. That reeks of medicinal herbs. Kjalner appears to have abandoned it. Nice, with potion. I found a useful looking potion in the dusty corner, maybe the score deeper based on floor. Explosion and receiving damage plus 10%. Receiving damage plus 10% this looks this must be good on high, right? Because like at least it is gonna take less hits, but whenever he does take hits, he's gonna get closer to his low health, so let me see. Excuse change count. Fine. Alright, cool. Damn, Pharos, I'll kill them all. Hi, we're taking a trip on the field right now. Don't be so edgy. Ooh. A wooden box. Well, I know where it goes. Tag to minus 35%. Healing powder, prezzo. Double attack. Hmm. Interesting. Yep, let's pick it for our hind. We need to purify the evil. Oh, is this a statue? Oh, what's this? Attack plus 15%. What the? What is this? I am a little bit worried right now, but what's gonna happen? Axe system version, take to go for data. Data recovery. Oh? Wait. There's something going on here. Something's not right. Don't you smile at me like that. I'm gonna find out what's uh, what's happening behind here. Hey, Otella, welcome. Thank you for showing up. I loved your name in your profile picture. I actually have Altera in Grand Order. It's so fun to use her. I think I don't have any choice besides here. Okay, cool. <laughs> That's a lot of damage. And he can't lacerate anymore. Oh, she's the one trying to lacerate. I was following already. Good thing you double check. <laughs> it's okay. Thank you for showing up. I'm glad you, you to have you here. I don't think I need to heal. 
I don't have any mana, so let's end the turn. Ouch! Okay. Things are starting to hit a little bit hard. But fortunately. Wait, 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 wait. No, the green part is actually healed by the end of the combat, so I can just. Done. Easy. Picking highs as a starter was a really good recommendation. Any soul stones? I do have soul stones. That means. Yo, I get Illusion's Word. Selfish turn to Tom Moss when he receives Illusion's Word. Okay. Lily, I need your help. Let's see how this works. Now, line that a version of Illusion's Word to your hand. Skill above and below the skill against Illusion Sword buff. Oh, so the position of the skills actually matter. Costs reduce whenever a zero skill card is played. Ignore Taunted Countdown 1. Hmm. I did the Bounty a month ago, and this went how long will take. Yeah! Get, like, getting characters in Bound 10 and Fate takes a long while, but I think it's worth it. I have like, currently I have Nero, Tamamo, Tamamo Cat, and Queen of Sheba, Elizabeth, and Hercules on rank 10, on Bond 10. I actually have a lot of, of characters on Bond 10, but that's because I've been playing for a long while, to be honest. To fix the skill, the cost for should be saved across turns. Oh, so wait. If I do this, so if I can, under if I understand the mechanics correctly, when I fix the skill, it works as if I always drew it. It's always in my hand, so to speak. So whatever action affects the card, we will continue throughout the turns. You don't have Grams and Altera, probably. Get more than next game and how much I use it for farming. Yeah, you if only one fighting member can use to fix skill by turn. Okay, I see. I don't have Gramps, unfortunately. I, I tried but failed to get him. But my Mordred is bone 5, I think. I don't really got her too high level. I don't use her, I much rather use like I'm not gonna lie, when it comes to Fate Grand Order, I like arts teams because I like to loop uh, noble phantoms and stuff. All right, some loot. We're doing fine. Let's keep going. Shift to run. I love how they run animations. Just basically. Oh no 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 no! Not yet. Not yet. We still have a lot to do here. Obtain two red or two red to use to three bad to obtain golden red. If I 20 health, no, 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 I'm not sacrificing 20 health. 20 health is a lot for where I am right now. So, let me find out what the golden bread was. It looks, oh, here it is, in curious faint status. Can't fire myself while I, was... increases max health of all allies, including us, including the future. This is good. If if I think this is good, yeah, yeah. There yeah, we got it, Brad. Where to now? Here's some fight here, but let me go to the corner here first. Ooh. I ma yeah, imagine like if you pick it late game, you had a lot of like wasted campfires. But you pick this early, it's so it much it, it stacks and such. I have one key, let's open this. Rose armor. Attack plus one, maximum health, minus evade. Attack three, healing power three, critical chance minus three. Your last goals for your soul stones coming up should be maybe getting two more lucid draw skills. With your max mana again. Alright, I see. So get maybe five mana and then getting more draws. Alright. Because I don't want like as many draws that I 
I I lack mana stone, so to speak. I have to find a balance so I don't have my hand full of cards with no mana or full of mana and no cards. The game to fall off and Rose Armor is good for tanks even later game. I'm gonna pick Re uh, Rose Armor. I don't have a tank yet, but let me equip this on Azar. Hi, I don't think it's needed. Let's say Azar is our tank for now. It's gonna draw out a bad luck to him, it's okay. Okay, I've been through here. So I imagine 3 is like as many characters as I can get, right? Or can I recruit more characters later on? Fartiers run in, in this case. Oh, what's this? Enemies are guarding this area. Let's fight it. Get 4 total. Nice. Alright, there's still space for 4. Cool. <laughs> Let's use this. Oh no, the Hedgehog is gonna attack me. A stack? <laughs> the Hedgehog on top takes an axe hit absorbing incoming damage. Oh, That's kinda bad. Do not screw it. Oh, they didn't correct. No hedgehogs for you. And now? <laughs> oh, right. I forgot the buff. Here it is. Illusion of his word is swiftness. So. Perfect turn. I am a natural at this. I just noticed, but it's a maid. Maid is so cute. I like this. Shake dust. The skill remains on the deck after the battle ends. Cast the skill to remove it from the deck. Oh, I see. Let me use the same battle where skill received. Oh, so it's like a debuff? It's a card that occupies my thing? Okay. I get it. It's a bad card, I see. In its effects. Alright, what's inside? What do we have here? Scarecrow Star? How much gold do I have? I have a lot of gold, so let me identify what this is. Transfer scroll, scroll. Spawns a relic display stand in front of the boss tile. I don't think I have a relic yet, right? Buy. I can buy skill books. Hasty heal. Interesting. Gain one minute turn. Maximum shot. I imagine gold coin is powerful, but it's way too expensive. Maybe I can get a key in the skill book. Brad, I don't think we're gonna need Brad. Why has potion? Which potions do I have? I have. Gain crit and wait. The enemy receive crit. Okay. And we're saying potions. Okay. Oh no! No 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 no! I want a gold coin. There we go. That's gonna leave me with a hundred gold. Nothing I can buy with it. Yeah, I'm not gonna buy the high heal. Let's take it. Maybe we're gonna get on another star later on. All right. Let me. Oh, this guy looks cool. Fantasy. Wait, I should not have used this right now. I am slightly stupid. So go ahead and keep it going whenever I get a chance. Wait, I have to equip it. Oh, I see. I have a thing. I'm gonna draw one more and discard them all. Ooh. This is gonna make me. How much damage did you do? 14. I don't think it's gonna. I mean, if I wait. Remove all weak. 
weakening. No, I don't have any debuff, so. Maybe I should wait. No, I don't know what they're gonna do. Hold up. I do as ice basic attack on the 18 health guy and then ice basic attack on either the maid or the 18 health guy. Okay. So attack on the 18 health. So this guy. Gonna attack me. Okay, not too much damage. What is it? The remaining attack skills will be used by consuming mana to start of the turn. This is like a taunt that makes you use all the skills automatically. And now here. And you know what? I don't shit. This is a problem. I cannot I cannot attack her. Shush. Did I use the wrong skill? Well too late for that. It's okay, it's okay. I'm sure. Yeah, just a little bit of dust. It's okay. It's okay. I can handle it. Um, psh, psh. yeah, here. Move her wind on the buff. Let's get some basic heal on her. Yeah, he's okay. He's doing fine. And one more. No, she's gonna act. Let's wait. Okay, it's dead. And now... Let me see the head down. Nah, it's alright, don't worry about it. Alright, perfect. Now we got two more. Let me equip this. Oh, I see, I see how it works. And more card draw. And I learned a skill. Let me see, Surge. Use skills to draw, order and select one to draw. You'll throw skills into the deck. The skill you select will not be drawn, but the remaining skills will be. This will activate Prophecy and cast twice. Select one of three random skills and deck and draw it. I think Surge is gonna be the best one, right? We're giving them both Prophecy, which is amazing. Yeah, but this the the random skills, right? Mm, well, a lot of the skills are like basic attacks and basic healing, so let's go for Divine Revelation. Let me just read Prophecy again see if I understand. It turns like one of you random skills from deck and draw it. So if I understand correctly, um, Revelation is gonna make me... Revelation is gonna make me like get more cards when I use it. Press this card above if you draw then we have prophecy. Oh I see, okay. So draw which must draw fractured illusions. Draw two skills and buff to an illusions word. The skill is faint the buff will not be applied. Okay, so from what I under understanding, that means some of these skills will buff my characters too. So draw one skill, one issue skill with two turns. I this must be good, right? I'm pretty sure one of the characters latest late spy had something like this. I think we're gonna pick Continuous Draw. What fashion would be really good? Because I have fantasy, right? Do I have fantasy? Yeah. Okay. Shoe card draw. Let's keep going. We have a fight here. Ooh, but first. I don't have any key. Well, make sure to spend shake this when you get a chance. Okay, it's alright. Whenever they show up, I'm gonna use them. Speaking of showing up, there is something here. Convert items into gold and select the skill I end up rated. Yeah, let's go for this. How does fantasy work when upgraded? Process reduce this hands a death star. By one mana skill exchange. Increase skill exchange by one. Play by hand. No, no, I don't think any of them is good. Oh, I can't. I can't go back? Like. 
Wait. If I pick one of the cards, I can't go back and remake my choice? Okay, I see. I can simply then skill except high. Oh, the synergy makes it work better. We just buy one in high, so Death Star. Okay, fine. And now? Sorry, Hazard. Hazard. Somehow we now have less HP than we had before. Let's keep going. Hopefully, I find a key on the way. Ooh. A pond? Fountain of Wishes. A magical fountain that is said to make wishes come true. As we get closer, the will of the fountain whispers to me. You are not capable of handling the power of my wishes. My wishes are too strong. Right now, I can only grant you very weak wishes. But, Fountain, I need your strongest wishes! Enter Bloody Park in the previous playthrough to prove your strength. Okay, as the wishes come true, the light disappears on the fountain. I can no longer be heard. Okay, so if I go to the Bloody Park, whatever this place is, then I'm gonna get something else from the fountain. I see. No idea what that means. <laughs> I see, I understand. What does he usually do, though? It only gave me a key so far. Eagle Eye. Eagle Eye? This looks pretty good for Heinz. Sorry, Heinz. I don't know why I said Heinz. So chill, my health can protect power with 50 head gauges protected. Yeah, I go for Eagle Eye. Oh, but Heinz already has two items. Shit. Wait, you will be good on Azar? Why? It's critical chance and accuracy. Let me attack. Oh, I see. Makes sense. So, since he's gonna be spamming attacks, even like minor critical buffs are gonna help him a lot, right? Accuracy and crit. I see. I think we got everything on the map, so. Wait, we did not fight her? Up there it is. How foolish of you to block my way. Oh, I think this is gonna be good. Hold up. First, I think we do this one. Should I use fantasy first or do I do go for factory illusion first? Factory illusion first. Since I can only. Alright, now I cast fantasy. Unless I can do a basic attack. I can do a basic attack. Cast fantasy. Yeah. The basic attack is gonna summon an illusion sword. And fantasy is gonna use the rest of my mana. And I'm gonna get like three I three cards costing zero. Sounds like the best option here. Oh, but I could... I just noticed, but if I had used in Fantasy first, it would have taken off the Shaken Off too, but it's okay, that's Physic Attack. Uh, this guy, screw it. Yeah, damage high is all we want, he likes it. High, not high, so I don't know what's wrong with me. Ooh. More zero cards. Oh, but this is gonna hurt. You know what? Screw it. This is gonna exclude swiftness, right? Okay. Oh, this is actually working. Ha! <laughs> perfect. That went perfect. You can exchange revelation as well. Oh yeah, I could have, but well, too late for that. Yeah, let me shake off the dust. Thank you. And oh, okay, never mind. I did not see the the thing. It's okay. Rat. How are my health? My health's okay. This has two uses, right? 
Is the gold coin like gone after use it two times or does it recharge at the campfire? Oh, that's a little bit dominoes. Oh! She's kinda cute, not gonna lie. I see what you got, child. With a curse skill in your hand sight of each turn. Your friends will perish by your own choices. Screw amazing your energy to turn out my cast it on all allies. I got to pick one to I'm gonna leave this for last, let me first. Unless if I use fantasy here, is it gonna discard the curse? Because that might be a good way out. Spend some before you turn it out so we cast on everyone. You know what? Oh, but it's only once per battle, right? Accelerate on fantasy? To reduce this thing? Yeah, nah. X on basic. On basic? Oh, so I got I see, I see. And now... Now I cast fantasy, correct? I think it's gonna be the best option here. What's this? This comes with deck. Let's cast a relation first. I got to choose. I don't think I need to heal for now, so I go. Hmm. Let me use the basic attacks first. I worry about that later. Oh, I just noticed she has a lot of HP. So, let me see what I can do. I can either do Mutilate, I can do Double Attack, which is gonna do less damage unless I quit in both. Just because the both of illusions work. Hmm. Wait, hold up. Is it do? Do skill cost. Yeah, I think I'm gonna use this. Is it gonna be... Mm. You know what? For now, we're gonna use Mutilate, I think. Cause it has a higher crit chance. See? Perfect. Let's end the turn. Moving down. Ooh, she summons. I don't like this. Very fine barrier. Don't really have. Oh, this removes the debuff. This is good because of the curse, right? So I'm gonna pick this. Alright, this time, here's what I'm gonna do. I'm gonna use this. Then, purifying barrier. Wait. I don't think that's how it's supposed to work, but... Ah, shit. Well. Wait, what just happened? Some reverse can't be disabled? Oh, that's why it has cannot be disabled on the description. Nice! The bus can be disabled. I understand now. That's what happens when the streamer cannot read. See? That's why you gotta send your kids to school. Might as well use this. Nice! Um, zero cost, so... Here. This has swiftness, right? So, bang. Bang. And we are done. Ooh, that hurts! This one's worth calling. Yes, this one's worth calling. Hmm. Targeting another ally who is able to figure them out. Okay, so if I cast this on. I see. I think. Let me see if I get lucky with Ted Rollins. Buffer. 
It was just basic attack. Yikes. Okay, let's kill her first. There we go, and now... Let's go on the offensive. Screw it. Okay, okay, yeah. That's what we gotta do. We can curse. What's it do? Attack minus 10%, healing power minus 10%. Yeah, let's get this on her too. Sorry. Prazel, I love you, but unfortunately, you're gonna have to take all the curses. Purifying Barrier is not gonna work, so screw it. Okay, you know what? Yeah. Let's go all out. King. Illusion. It's not 50%, so there we go. And basic attack. Oh, that hurt! Holy shit. Crucifying curse, what does it do? Horrendous pain. 5 damage per turn. Yeah. You can take a little bit of pain, it's alright. I know he can handle it. Oh no. A quick question. Do these like random enemy attacks? Do they ignore tanks? They ignore taunts? Or are they always gonna hit the taunter? I gotta try this, hold up. Okay, it's case. Wait, swiftness first, yeah. Oh, it does ignore, nice. Ow. It's okay, it's okay, it's okay, it's okay. We're doing fine. We are actually doing... Oh, so close! Okay, let me think. Um, horrendous pain. Five damage per turn, screw it. Hind, you take the pain out. Ooh. Yeah, I can go berserk all we want, because now Hind's gonna give it to you. And that. See, two bosses down. I have no idea how many we have to go. Oh. Wait, 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 wait. I thought. Thought was gonna end here. It's okay, it's okay, it's okay. It's alright. Storming blade. Done, okay. Alright, good to know. Unlock the new boss. Are the bosses randomized? Hmm, might be a problem. What have? Pomus blessing, nice. Cast one random skill, including skill for investigators. Okay, gold, soul stones, witches curse. Let's create a crucifying curse skill. Skill book. Okay, a key. More soul stones and more credits. All right. Let me just use this. No, let's wait for the skill because. We're probably going to be able to recruit someone soon. Oh, this is the relic. Let me check something then. We got a piece of... Whatever this is, and let's go to the next stage. Alright, before I go to the campfire, I want to check something. What happened for... This is gonna activate on my hand, right? It's not gonna like cast a curse on me. Correct? Or this is like gonna fuck me over. You know what? Let's, let's go here. 
Oh, they're all so cute seeing here. So you can fire the yeah, gonna use this. Oh nice. Key key, okay, nothing else. The rest of the skill but on Cool, perfect. Blacksmith? Nah, don't wanna use it. But I can upgrade. Prophecy cost two less. Wait, did I increase the skill exchange by one? And what am I upgrading here? Skill, skill exchange cost. Oh, I see, I see. Exchange by one blade from hand. Um, sorry, I did not see what I was upgrading, so I speak this. Oh, I see, I give this effect to any of the cards I want, right? So, for example, I could pick Profit, uh, this one, put it on Mutilate, and then Mutilate is gonna cost two less when summoned by Prophecy, right? I see. So, let's go for Mutilate, yeah. go uh, nothing else I can use no let's sleepy we are awakened and now no 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 I don't want to exit let's keep going oh there up you told me about the skill right you told me this was good I remember this one always lands against a target to weakening the buff tax an additional enemy if facing one enemy damage is increased by eight I see is she just <laughs> the Prezzo has a bonk skill? Not gonna lie, it's gonna be very useful against me, but with <laughs> an enemy. Holy sheesh. Plus 100% crit chance. Illusion flash adds an additional attack to deals a damage. For each illusion sword and illusion sword buff in hand. Nice, this is very good too, but I think we're gonna go with Tira. Trip's gonna be good for for when we have multiple enemies. I just love the fact that out. Wait, I clicked out of my turbo. I love the fact that <laughs> Prezzo has a skill that just bonks people's uh, bat. Wait, is that how she attacks? Just like bats people to death. That's so cool. Ooh. This will be different. Wait. It is! Holy shit, how did I not see that? That's so cool! I love her. She's gonna be my favorite character, I knew it. Oh yeah, mana. There we go. Now I have five mana, I have two card draws. Maybe I should get a little bit more card draws later or increase the characters, we'll see. Wait, this is a carnival team. Is it a bloody thing? Protector and criminal. Yeah, criminal thing is good for us, right? But. Now oh, he's not a tank. The rose armor has always plus one. Um, yeah, that's the crypto zone as I. Then we'll, we'll save the Rose Armor for later. I think he's gonna like accuracy more than he likes health, right? Before we go... I just wanna know if I'm on Hind? Wait, why on Hind is like... It's gonna, don't we want his HP to be low? So he can activate his things more frequently? We do, however, however, the moment the boost is really bad. <laughs> no, oh, it's okay. Yeah, it like it lowers the critical damage, right? Increases your chance, but lowers the damage. I see. But here's the thing: I have the high crit rate because. Oh no! Never mind.
Wait, why is this critical so low? Oh, oh no, never mind, never mind, I understand. His base critical is minus, minus 4. With the brute, it gave me plus 35, and the multi late has plus 50. I see, I see. I get it. Now all the things are starting to make sense in my head. Ooh, here we don't have another key, so... I imagine whenever I see this thing is uh, where I'm gonna see the boss, right? Now basically 50 but the lower key damage really sucks. Yeah, it was like 60%. More hedgehogs! Why are they red? Oh, they taunt? Um, accelerate and mutilate. Ooh, perfect. Do I need a heal? I don't think so. I cannot hit him. Okay, so here. Wait, why are they? They have eighty percent armor. Oh. Yikes. I don't need a healing, so what if I... Yeah, what if I did this? Here. Push and con sword. Okay, fine. Let's see how much damage they do. Seven. Weak. Eight. It's starting to hurt a bit, but we're doing fine. Oh. Why did you attack twice? Skin dex can say it will be. Wait, 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 wait. Oof. You? I think I screwed this up. This ignores taunt, of course. Alright, cool. Uh, yeah, let's see if Storming Blade can help us. It can, perfect. That should work. More health, less evade. Okay. And more soul stones. How many soul stones do I need to. Oh, three. Let's get the draw card once more. No, we're, we're, we're good on draw cards. Let me upgrade Heinz. End of the line, Bloodstorm, Kira. End of the line is what I have, Bloodstorm, Space of the Caster Health. Okay, so this one's the one that like, the low, the, the less damage I have, the better. Does more damage. Still up, and I start to put in the buff. Mm, I'm gonna pick it up, but here's the thing, I don't think I have any card that... Has a weak need buff, yeah. Eh, we're gonna, we're, we'll see. Um, whenever Heinz fit an with the skill, cast again. Half damage, not again. Alright. Okay. Take off end of the line. Wait, but... I see. But here's the thing, I don't have anything that gives me weakness. If I don't have anything that gives me weakness, isn't it just like a worse attack? Oh, ignore stomp. That's good, actually. What I need right now is a key. Blood bank. Use one key and risk 15 chance. It's gonna sacrifice 20 health. 20 health is a lot. Do I really need to do this? Think so. You know what? I just noticed, but here on the blood lottery, I can gamble, right? So let's do a little bit of gambling. 20 health is a lot for us, so we do a little bit of gambling here. Hand over the ticket. Or a snatch a prize. A clown lottery with various prizes. As we get closer, a soliciting clown reveals a pleasant smi unpleasant smile. <laughs> do you want to try your luck at the lottery? Then show me a ticket. What is this ticket? A long... What's this ticket? A long and hard stick. 
clown I am not into this I am very sorry I might be a clown myself but I am not into other other clowns the thing you can open anything if you know what I mean this is all new things for something I don't like it so 50 50 right let's see if it looks on my side I guess not oof but you can open an item <laughs> that's good that's good so ancient shield when battle size create a party barrier of seven super boss defeated with was 50 percent a five percent receiving crit chance weakening the buff to all enemies would you look at that exactly what we wanted isn't it that's gonna make tear up stronger, right? See, all works out in the end. I am doing very well right now. Try to snatch one of the prizes to the ticket, but I was caught by the clown. I grabbed the prize and I managed to escape, but somehow I don't feel so good. Oh no, I'm gonna disappear. Oh yeah, now I have the backpack. Cannot be used. Wait. So this is just gonna live in my mind forever? Like there's no reason to actually do it. Oh, nice. Thank you, base clown. Speaking of clowns, now I can use this. Because with the transfer scroll, I can activate the strawberry. Perfect. Let's see what's here. Convert items into gold. Mm. If you get that card wrong, it's just gonna sit in your hand and let somehow get scared by another effect. I see, I see. It's not that bad. I don't think it's the worst card I could roll, but. Garbage dump, convert items to gold. Should I convert these items or should I just like. Well, Cupid Necklace is like a one thing, so maybe I should. Hmm. You know what? I, I want to test my luck. I want to see what I can get on the scrolls. A facility that collects and disposes of all garbage in Bloody Park. Just being nearby makes me want to vomit, but maybe we can find something useful. Dumpster diving, curse skill banana peel. Lily, I require assistance. What is the banana peel curse skill? I imagine something bad, but how bad is it? Is it like game ending bad? Is it like manageable? Is it can we ignore it? What do you think? I never risk because it's really annoying. Alright, I see. So let's go just for the paper scrolls. Disables all curses from equipped items. Transforms an item into gold. And ha! It all worked out in the end. See? I went dumpster diving, I got the scrolls to transform the items into gold. And I still have one to disable curses. Luckily I don't have any cursed item right now. So let's fight. Oh look, she's so cute! Miss Ghost. Is that Raymo? That's so adorable. Wait. What is this? Why, is, why are there shadows here? I don't like this. Dodge attack. Suppose we move both receiving attack that costs more than zero. Whenever a miss goes into an attack, there are two or more attack skills in your hand. It's like one to exclude. I see. So if I understand this correctly. I do this. Wait, it didn't work? Once we move to receive an attack that costs more than zero, but I did an attack. Oh, I see, I see. Let's go for Fantasy 10. Clean coil. Ah, heavy backpack is zero, but it's useless. Well, 
Should we hit the, cr the clown or... Wait, no, this is... Yeah, I mean them. Hold up. There we go. Maybe it's gonna be... You know what? Go ahead, do your worst. Oh, never mind. Holy shit, the rip's powerful. This is so good. Wait. Why is it a battle over yet? Um. Oh, the enemies. I see. Oh, these have lots of HP. Alright, but everything is going fine. I can't switch, right? Uh, yeah, I have zero. So... Oh, it didn't kill. Ooh, ah, okay, okay, I can take a little bit of damage. Broken, if it's too damage to cast any of the skills. Alright, it's okay. He's a big boy, he can handle it. And, battle's done. Easy. An identification scroll. I like, like, when games give you magic items that you have to identify to use. I try to apply that to my D&D group, but like, all they do is cast identify and find out where it is. Note pile of skeletons. That looks a bit too easy, I think this is a trap. No? Okay. Let me get Prassel to level... And now double heal. The prophecy we have chain heal a selected ally after one countdown. One second to make a prophecy. Very fine battle I already have. This one costs three. This one's a little bit expensive, I think. Which one defeats an enemy. But it's kind of good. Prophecy, it's kind of a critical chance. In the ask of double heal. If I understand this correctly, I, I will heal someone twice might be good so here and now where is Heinz sorry not Heinz as I okay as I will level three tools word of infinity all skills in hand gain an illusions word buff if this skill has an illusions word buff it's not excluded Ooh. sorry blade I already have this is cost zero Gain a hundred percent critical chance. Oh, okay. So, I imagine either Sword of Infinity or Shining Hour are good here, right? So let me go for. Let, let me go for Sword of Infinity, so I can get my. So I can get the Storming Blade down faster. Yeah. And then we use Word Buff. Okay. And later on, if I get that one skill that does damage based on how many illusions, illusions words buffs I have, that's gonna be very useful. So let's pick this. All right, we're doing fine. And go, nice. Let's pick up a fight with someone. Freddy Fazbear, can't believe he's here. We're gonna fight Freddy. I don't like this. Unstable machine. Wait, what? Does it turn damage to character? You seem damage increased by 6%. Oh, so if I damage him with someone else that isn't the first one, what a good plushes. I know the plushes are so cute! I feel I feel bad having to fight them. Look at them! They're adorable! Unfortunately... They're gonna have agony. 
Alright, what if I... Let me think this a bit, hold on. Yes. Fucking kill Freddy fast, right? This is zero, right? So if I... I don't think it's worth to like... Oh, but I can do this! Haha! <laughs> I don't think fence is gonna be useful here, maybe accelerate. Yeah, that's what we're gonna do. Oh but I was very stupid, I picked the wrong I always forget I have to pick one to delete. But it has I just noticed HP, holy shit! I think this is gonna hurt. Alright, here it is. Um Two, two, five. Hold up. Let, let me think. This is gonna work. That's damage by Azai. So now I can damage him with this guy. Oof. Okay, not too much damage. We can handle this. It's less. It was not damaged by things yet. So maybe fantasy. Just double heal. I think I screwed up actually. I should have used Moot late. Well, too late. Oof. Deep bleeding. Alright, and here's the crops. Next crops still have one bonus action. Okay, it's over. Freddy, what are you gonna do? Oh, this is a prophecy. This is gonna cost zero. What way it's gonna cost zero? This is gonna be useful. So, draw two skills to buff him with. Nice. Sword calling. Oh, that's a lot of zero skills. Ah. If I had the one, like, that one skill would be so useful right now. So. Late. Ooh. Um, shit. Well, it's okay. Rotate. I think he's dead. Let me see if I'm right. And Freddy Fazbear is dead. We did it. No more Five Nights at Freddy. Finally, it's over. Can't believe it's finally over. No more jump scares for children. I think people are gonna be hurt if I say this, but I don't have anything to identify, right? No. It's an identification scroll, not that I need to identify it. Wisdom Tooth Jar. All allies pain above so does by 33%. Enemy resists a pain above, deal damage you go to the. I don't think it's that useful. One random rare skill of a selected ally to your hand. I think I'm gonna pick the key. Because there's something that I wanna open. Should we gamble with the unknown scroll? You know what? Yeah. Here. And here. Just to be sure. In case I get another bakery, I can get more golden bread. Alright. It's a swiftness scroll. <laughs> this is gonna be good. Increases during this stage. So it's gonna last a little bit more than a fight. Like market. Let's go to one skill. Use pay soul stones to buy an investigator. Rare skill upgrade a skill. Let's go to the black market. Let's get a rare skills, rare skill upgrade one skill. Let me upgrade. What do you have for me? So I can just four for healing skills. Mm, I don't think this is gonna be useful, maybe this is one. 
Com a sua dos Baichu. Yeah, if Sword of Infinity summons this. Yeah, it's gonna, I think it's gonna be good. And that's it. Only one choice. Alright, I see. Well, time to test our luck. Let's see what we got. A tank? Wait, why are we fighting a tank in a fucking clown carnival? What? What? <gasps> what? Wait, 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 no, 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 this is... Hold, hold, hold up. I, I don't like where this is going. Wait, 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 wait. Okay, let me think, let me think. I can make this work, we can survive this. So, healing coil. So she's gonna heal herself and someone else. Now I can cast this word of infinity. And I can heal. Okay. Destroy out of death door. So maybe. Alright, no, no, I can handle this. I know, I know, I know. This is this is good. I can't use this. Okay. Wait, 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 wait. Give me a heal. I know I know we can handle this. Heavy backpack, you Oh no, Prezzo, please. Please survive. I. Wait. Wait. Thank you, Chris. Can change color with you. What for you, sis? Okay, that's all the works. Maybe a party? Yeah. Block. Okay, this is gonna save us, I'm sure. I'm sure this is, this is, this is alright. We can survive this. He didn't attack? Oh, that's so... I am so glad. Thank you. I am going to switch this. Basic healing. Um, oh, I think he's gonna attack now. Alright, okay. Let me see what I can do. I can gear up. Then it's gonna attack twice and gonna death with seems healing reduced. It's alright, it's okay, it's okay. So count down one by nine, I think. I th minus three. This is gonna be the best one. He has a puppet now, I did not see this before. Oh no. Ooh, but okay, we're doing fine, we're doing fine, we can handle this. As long as he doesn't shoot again, we can survive. Ah, it's a death star. Yeah, but it's not a death star, shit. Divine revelation, I need this. Um, shit here. I picked the wrong card again. I cannot believe this. Rendo debuff. Okay, that actually worked. Cool. Drums of weakening. He's not shooting again. Okay, we're fine. We're doing fine. You can handle this. It's not a big deal. One HP! Come on! Feels like every three, four turns. Okay, good. That means it's over. Alright, we're doing fine actually. We are doing...
This guy scares me. Society. We're gonna have to fight a fucking Joker next turn. I am already dreading my second run here. Firecracker, just for them for all enemies every time. Black Fog arrives. Black Fog is the thing that summon enemies, right? I see, cool. Alright, let's leave this place, please. Yeah. Let's sleep now. Oh, I can recruit. Hold up. Yeah, now I don't have much choice, so I have to pick the tank. And I don't think there's any other choice for a tank that the, the cute girl with the chainsaw. Let's see how she works. She gains burn when she casts a skill or fixes ability. Elf gauge is protection during burn. During bonus effects and cast during burn. I see. So the thing is, if I attack, att I. La 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 la. Sorry. If I attack with her, I get a buff, and then I attack again, I get another buff. Okay. And now we have a full party. Blacksmith. Can I put the relic and something else? And we forge. I'm not sure how useful the firecracker is. That's that's gamble. Let's see how it works. And it doesn't work. It has to be two things. What if I use this? Oh, now this is ah oh, minus accuracy. I don't think this is that good. Well. Um, yeah, it's okay. Less sleepy. Oh, poor hedgehog. Counter attack enemy for in counter attack enemy actions. Counter will miss shame removed when you attack the target. Death's door immunity after a two stacks prevents enemy from RC. So if I have one stack, it basically counterattacks, two stacks it taunts, and three stacks I am immune to Death Star. This sounds pretty good. Pursuit. Pain damage equal to 25% of max health. I imagine it deal three of the target skills, it's quite part of the was two. I imagine pursuit does not work against bosses, right? Because it, it seems pretty strong if it works against bosses. Engine reload. Just ask for one enemy. Prevents health from enemy below once. Now by 20% I will increase but cast on an ally. Oh! Oh! I think I'm gonna, I'm gonna pick this one. Ooh, one more. What's here? Fire ground. When attacked, this buff is removed. By one, healing gauge protection, some skills enhanced. When attacked, this buff is removed and applies reveals burn to the attacker. I see, this is cool. Let's assist. Right. Blinking heal, choose one. Increase the target's chance to be attacked or reduce your chance to be attacked. Oh, I see. I think that's the better one. Dentist scroll, swiftness scroll, scroll of meters, we don't need this. You know what? How's your accuracy, miss? Let me increase my mana. Hold up. There we go. Um, her accuracy is 130%. So, what about everyone else? 120. Yeah, but it's 120 because of the thing. So what happens if I... Okay, the accuracy is still 105%. It's actually good. This was a good change. So now for her, I will equip this. Just so she doesn't go around naked. Wait. No, I don't want this, but... First of all, here it goes. Can I take it off, actually? Oh, I can, but I will need to... Yeah, it wouldn't work. I can't go back to the camp and... 
I can! Wait, 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 let me try something then. Um, from what I gathered, the firecracker is not that good. But which is curse is a free zero card, right? Nah, let's keep it then. Yeah, let's keep this. What is this though? There's a fundraiser. Um, I don't have that many gold, I'm sorry. I am poor and I cannot help you with gold. Okay, since I have tears and it's during the stage, I imagine it works during the entire area. So let's cast it. First, there we go. Nothing here. Ooh, we started a fight. Ghost Chan! How foolish of you to block my way. Um, just to skip your deck, yeah. Um, you know what, clown? Inflate balloon. What's? Is it in the smoke? Remove the random buff. Yeah, I don't need this. Word of infinity. Also, can take the animations word buff. Alright, let me think. Um, here. I can. I don't think I actually need this, but. Um. Okay, that worked. Cool. Now, if I cast Purifying Barrier, I'm gonna get to one card. But. Hmm. I know I'm gonna have to do this to take the buff off. Yeah, I don't want this. Not for now. So, Fantasy. Oh, this is good. What's fast illusion do to skills and illusion to strength? Alright, we're doing fine, so. Oh, ho, ho, ho. This build's so good. Alright, let me basic heal her. This build is actually so good. Lily, thank you for letting me do this. This idea of using like illusion swords, so fun. I love this build like the ship. Have you ever played Slate Aspire? There's a similar build with the Silent that's like stacking sheaves that are low damage, zero cost cards. Have... No, don't worry, I also suck dicks at it. And <laughs> the ship build is so fun. The Silent is my favorite character on it, but I suck with her. Alright, what does this do exactly? When attacked, this buff will... It's a buff that reduces damage next attack by 1. When attacked, this buff is removed and applies moves on to attacker. So if I use this, everyone gets the buff. And everyone is burned. Nice! I see. Well, I don't need this one. Hold up. I really don't need this. I threw this away to my hand. Yeah, but it's not really useful because she still has to... It's not gonna do anything, right? Oh, never mind, actually... Wait. Can't they not be dodged? Am I misreading the skill? Aggro reduce, aggro increase. Oh, I can give aggro to one of them. I see how it works now. Illusion sword. Basic contact. I understand how this game is working right now. So. Can't use it anymore? No? Fine. 
in turn. Alright! I am slow with getting the hang of this. I think I am starting to understand how this works. But first, what do we have inside here? Ooh, two of them! Can't resist. When a battle starts, the wearer has one cost skills in the deck, which is a 5 damage bonus. Mm, and this one, attack with searing power, critical chance. Just a lot of stat, stat buffs. Frozen Turrican seems situational, and Moonface looks like our rounder, so I might pick Moonface and give it to Prezel maybe because of the healing power. Or since it's just like a stat stick, I can just give it to Miss Chain. Hmm. I gonna, I don't know how many one cost skills Miss Chain have. I can go back to check, right? I can actually hold up. Um, all right, so basic attack, basic attack, and illusions ward. Fire round, zoom. All right, she even has a basic heal, and she only has heal. Okay. The rarest ones cost heal receive a five damage bonus. I'm gonna pick the moon phase, yeah. Moon phase, and now Miss Chain. Here's another ring for you as a proof of our wedding. Well, but not really gonna wed you, but sorry, I aim for Prezel. Let's fight. Oh, just a lonely hedgehog. Oh no, not a ideal situation. Does this card all zero costs? Okay, so. Let me think, I'll skill the names for the buff. Mm. Okay, come down. I don't there's nothing else I can do actually so let me just It's okay I still have a lot of buffs okay. I don't need this I don't have this on you Um, is there a limit of how many Kai's I can hold on my hand? Or can I just keep stacking Kai's forever? Okay. Alright, perfect. Perfect illusion. No, I, I got... I, I... Yeah, I cannot stack them forever. Oh, but it's alright, it's alright, it's okay. I still will do a fuck ton of damage here. Oh, they're crits! Not cast this. I don't have any. Can't accelerate the skills. No. In this case, yeah. Storming blade and finish. This build so fun, so good. Assemble, remove all pain debuffs, lots of stuff. You know what? Identify an item. You can identify. Let me buy another key. I only have exactly. What I need for a key. So I'm gonna grab that. And now, let me level up Azar because he's the one that's like doing all the heavy lifting, so to speak. 
and ignores. It just has a illusion of buff with a real critical hit. Oh, this is good. I'll see the handgun illusion buff at two illusion swords. Nah, this is gonna be the best one, I think. More illusion swords is better. And now that I know that I have a limit of how many cards I can hold in my hand, that's gonna be a little bit easier to manage. Wait. I thought it was something I should use, but it's okay. Where now? Here, let's just tell apart. Okay, go to spin a rare to win prizes. If you choose an item and preserve it, the party is annihilated, you can start with this item on the next run. Um, is there any item that I think is really good and should start the next run with? Honestly, I think I wanna I wanna try my luck. I really wanna try my luck. Let's go. That one and win a thousand. Do you want to try your luck at the ultimate prize? Oh, I should. Oh, I got it. Ha, <laughs> perfect. I'm so good at this game. As the casino closes, the circle of laughter disappears and a creepy silence fills the atmosphere. The door no longer opens. But it's, it's open. It's open, open here. The game is lying to me. Blood Rink, Decrepit Forge, Small Equipment Relics, and Active Items. Often items of another type. What can I smelt here? Maybe. This? Hmm. I don't think there's anything I can actually smell. Well, let's unlearn at least. Let's go south. Boss fight here? Nope, not yet. Another fight here. Let's still have a round first. Ooh. Upgrade cube, upgrade one ally skill change to downgrade a different skill. Nope. Here. I am converting my scroll of Midas into gold directly. This, my friends, is the art of the trade. I am a genius. Let's keep going up. Lifting scroll. What's here? Southwest. Oh. Wait, I, I was supposed to have a key. I forgot to buy it. Where is it? Here. Give me the key. Thank you. Now I can go down and buy this thing. I can open and we get Rusty Hammer! Or Unk. Killing power, critical chance, weakness, accuracy. I think the hammer is gonna be very good for Hein, right? Because that's gonna give him a lot of critical damage. See, I can change the ring. So he has like a, a slightly lower evade and less damage, but the critical, the more critical damage is gonna be very good, I think. What do you think? You are the specialist here. I only got this far because of your guiding hand. Can guide me toward the path of victory. What do I pick? What's everyone's wearing? Hold up. Okay, Prezel has two healing items. The Hands of Prayer and the Token of Protection. So, as you can see, she has no attacks. She's only focused on healing. Um, Hein has the Fugitive's Ring. More damage received and more evade. And the Rose Armor. Plus one attack and maximum health. And minus evade. Azar has the Eagle Eye, Accuracy and Critical Chance, and the Berserker's Ring, that gives him less accuracy, but thanks to the Eagle Eye, it balances out. Miss Chain is using the Criminal's Ring, plus one attack and accuracy, and the Moon Phase. 
this is what everyone's wearing. I think here you can see exactly what everyone's doing. Worst case scenario, I can pick whatever and just like... And just... I don't know actually. We'll be confused these items later. Our choices here are the Unk and the Rusty Hammer. If you get the Hammer, take the Roll Armor off and put it on the Hammer. Yeah, that's what I was thinking. That is a lie, I was actually thinking of taking the ring off. But I have to, like, look smart, you know? Thank you for your guidance. Um, keep the fish to ring, the Rose Armor. Should I keep her on. I think it's a good idea, actually. She's our damage dealer, so. She's our tank, so it makes sense that she has a lot of health, right? Okay, now we have a battle. Let's see how we, do, we fare on that battle. Then after this, that, that's gonna be a loss. Ooh, that's a lot of people. The so attack. Divine. But she doesn't really have burn, I think. So let's get sword calling. Oh, I am stupid, never mind, sorry. And now she has a talented protection, nice. Correct, yeah, barrier, healing out protection, two stacks. Uh, so falling, counter attack. Let me think what I can do now. When only buff, basic. Maybe we should just like. What is this? Taunted when his chain rolls and attack the target. Um. Yeah, that's steer up. It's okay. Ooh, perfect! They have healers! Nice! It's okay, I can handle it. A fire ground. I still have a burn stack. That means I can just give everyone protection. Nice. Now, what do I have here? Mm, quiet. I don't need healing, so. Let me rotate this. Add two illusions. Nice. Add two cards and give the illusion buff. Oh, perfect. Haha. <laughs> Oot late, baby. Oh, the damage. Gain the buff. Holy shit, this is so good. <laughs> Not even a single hit taken. We are doing fine, we are doing swell. What's this? Transported bread. Burn my bread. Persona 3 has been released now that I remember it. Oh. We're fighting balloons? Gain a buff from surprise party balloon. We're moving to the balloon spot. Gain a buff from killing balloon. Balloon spot. Gain a buff from. Wait, explosive balloon. Gain a buff from healing balloon. Oh, I see, I see what it means. So now I will... Wait, what? Oh, I did not read all the skills. Alright, it's alright. Let's just... I don't even have fire ground. Everyone's turn. It's gonna pop? No, just spend. Oh, look at the clowns. Is 
it's alright, it's alright, it's, it's no problem if wait there's still Why are they still stunned? How long does this take? Alright, you know what? Let's get go for fire round. Could be worse, but it's gonna be the best we can do. Oh, he's just gonna keep inflating his balloons? Fine. That might have been a bad idea. I just popped everything I had, and now everyone's stunned. No, it's actually fine, never mind. Everything worked fine in the end. No, 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 you're not gonna summon anything. Hold up. Two. Nice, perfect. What's gonna pop? Of course, there's another balloon. Uh, Wait a minute. Ooh, okay. Now it's doing a little bit more damage than I expected. You? Oh, he crit! He do be critting. Binking you? Yeah, binking you. And... Blue hour. I don't want people to attack high. I want people to attack everyone else. You gotta be kidding me. Alright, edge out gone. So now we have to give this guy. Mutilate. And done! The crits are on our side today. Not gonna like that was a little bit scary. This transforms an item into a better item. He activated and I see sacrifice one class skill and upgrade one skill. Sacrifice one class skill. Those like stuff like basic attack counts. You know what? Let's let's do this. Can I transform our Potion into King to Relic and Reactive Item. What if I equipment? No, there's gotta be something better. Does this count? No. This is a scroll, it doesn't count either. What happens? No, 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 screw with this. I'm not gonna mess around with this. How about this? There we go, let's pick a key. I get the feeling Nussi's Crow is still gonna be useful, so I'm not gonna use it for now. I don't wanna ruin my chances. Oh, what's this? Oh, it's just a minus hand thing. Alright. Time for a fight. Oh no! They're... I better not say what I think of them, but. Holy shit. Um. All right. Um, cannot be disabled to boss share health. Okay. Fine. It's gonna be fun. Um. Yeah, alright. So, plants can be used for time with all stigmas. I don't need this one. I cannot rotate the clans. A bit weird. Okay, I know what I can do. Never mind. Just this was. Has a lot of loose words. Wait, 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 wait. You know what? Let's wait. 
If I use this, it's probably gonna trigger the thing, right? Yeah. So we we're, we're in the turn. Dodge, nice. Okay, that was nice. What's zoom do? Armor minus 30%. This is good. Mana cost increased by two. Unfortunately, this has no mana cost. <laughs> okay, let me think. Alright, perfect. Perfect fine barrier. This is cannot be I don't think it's gonna remove. So let me just rotate this. Yeah, let's go full aggro. Oh, that might have not been a good idea. Cast 8 damage whenever you cast... Wait! Wait, 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 wait. No, 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 no. This is getting a bit... You. Yeah, you. You have a lot of stigmas. I don't want to remove them. I mean, I don't want to remove you from this fight. Shooter. Wait, what? Did I? Oh, okay, I, I always forget to up is like... You have to wait. <gasps> oh, he's a death star! Give me some... No, now end of the line is gonna be a good time to use. Okay, I might have miscalculated things a bit. I think I've miscalculated. Oh no. <laughs> All right, I want. Yeah, let's focus on her. We're just calling. Counter when attack. Yeah, so we attack her. This might have turned into a difficult situation, to be honest. But I think we can still do fine. Though we can't fight. Ooh! Use this to I can does remove the stigmata, nice. It doesn't remove the thing. Oh no basic protect. Why does this illusion word cost two? This is madness. I'm gonna cost my two. Oh no, she's a Death Star. I, I think I fucked up. No, never mind, she uses health. Woo. Yeah, I got fantasy, but ah, that's not gonna be useful. I don't have any zero cost skills. I have. Hi, Bumner. <laughs> Welcome. I think you arrived just in time to see me. Oh! Lily, thank you so much! If it wasn't for this, I would have been dead. I swear to... Oh! Lily, my savior. I owe my life to you. <gasps> A party member! That's so cool! Cookies! Oh, it's a badge. I thought it was a cookie at first. Ghost badge. This really is plus 10, 20. Alright. One more part. We lose this necklace for seeing the bonfire. The bonfire doesn't revive people. 
right? I always thought it would revive, but... Alright. There you go. Um, how do I... Oh, yes. Forgot. I gotta click. Click, click, click. Oh, look at everyone around the fire. Okay, camping item, golden bread. On fire will rest, some will not fire a lot. Oh, I see, I see what you mean. Alright, we're all fine. Don't think there's anything else I can use that's bonfire only. Upgrade. Apply a pain to buff that lasts raw one skill. Mm. Press home to get more HP if they're sitting down, also fire which is like this. Oh, I see, I see. I understand now. So, revive people with the necklace so they restore more HP whenever they sit at the campfire. I see. The pain debuff to 50 damage. Is the pain debuff worth it? It looks a little bit low to be honest. But we're all one skill. Mm -mm. I go for the pain debuff. It's worth if you're doing a pain build, but you're not. Oh. If I understand correctly, pain works like it deals damage when the enemy acts, right? So if I'm not doing a lot of a build that's supposed to work with that, I don't think it's gonna be useful, yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. In this case, let's just draw one skill. And I'm gonna put it on end of the double attack. I like double attack, sorry. So, I want to use these two items to reforge. Oh, endless magic, attack plus one, healing power plus one, critical chance, evade, cannot be cursed. Nice. I think, actually, hold up. I think that would be a good item for Prezzo, but... Just not really... No, I think she's good, I think she's good. Yeah, let's keep her like this. So let me level him. But one if the healing gauge remains. Because the roof of death door. And then for weakness, success chance. I don't need this, but but it does increases my armor. Lily, I need your professional opinion. Is identify weakness worth it if I already have a source of weakness? Or should I pick Rage Slash? I forgot to say. Let me hydrate. Hold up. Okay, so I, I can get more than 5 cards, but it's usually not a good idea. In this case... Can I go back? No. You know what, let's pick Identify Weakness, I think. Alright, I see. I can also forget skills, like, if everything gets worse. Should I get the card draw? Do you think it's worth it? Currently my card draw is true, I think I should get one more. Because, like, last fight I was very close to forgetting it. Speaking of forgetting, hold up, I want this. Because otherwise I'm not gonna use it. Um, burning draw, the ultra skills from the deck and give burn to a target. Um, let's go for continual draw this time. I'll skill, you know, skip two turns. Okay. Maybe one more, just to be sure. Tactical plan, cast one of the random skills, cast two skills that I give burn. I go for tactical plan, I think. There goes. Alright, I think we are well. I smell blood. So let's keep going. It's getting a little bit late, so I think this is gonna be my last stuff for now. Usually, how many stages to Chrono White has? 
Is it a spoiler to... To ask this? Like, uh, how many bosses? So, good guys get 5 skills on each person. I have your carry DPS. I have gotten About 5 and 8 guys. I see. So, now I should focus on Azar, so to speak. Block bank. Preserve it. Right. Clearly, you can. Alright, you know what? Let's preserve this. If things get bad, we can just keep it safe. I love how, like, depending on where you are, the event, the place changes. I think that's so cool. Oh, and it's no longer vines. Now it's ice. Also, with 50 gold to attempt a trial, you can obtain prizes and more damage will build. I don't have the thing right now but I can go here come here later right yeah I'm gonna get five go more gold eventually it's okay this flower, this flower demands your wealth or luck so rest you can be obtained off tower you a random rare skill of each member and learn one then replace one rare skill that you already own with sacrifice knowledge I don't remember already has a very skill. Should I try to slash your tower? Is it like hard fight or I love cheating. If you don't cheat, what is wrong with you? It's a card game, right? In card games, like cheating is basically the main thing you have to do in card games. Yeah, I do hope that's what you mean, because if you're talking other stuff. Then we might need to have a talk in private. By the way, welcome playing this fade. Hope you're doing well. Let me go over Celestial Tower, season to move its luck. Use stairs, if you to lose one random potion or lose elevator. Let's use the stairs. It's okay if I lose a potion. Uh, middle floor, so that we should use 32% chance to curse all equipment. Nah nah, I'm not gonna use this. Cursed. I don't have any gold. Hmm. 30. Th oh, look. Forget some people in the race has been doing fact. <laughs> I do in fact in academic dishonesty. It is their enormous relationships. It should have been me! Anyway. 33% chance. To gain lucky curse. To, sorry, cursed watch. Let's see if the gods are on my side. And they're not. Cannot be used, draw one or more skill. Why this skill is in hand? If you play eight skills, you turn automatically end. Oh no, I hate this. There is one boss in in Slate Aspire that has this ability and I never was able to defeat it. The fucking time snail. But I got this at least. <laughs> I haven't had a real toss since 2013. I understand that feeling. Okay, let's use this. Raid. No one costs one less, and Chris the damage consumed. Change burn. Or maybe as yeah, we're gonna we're going for Azar, so Wait, sorry, what's the buff again? If the if played from hand, the next skill with illusions where it costs one less. Time is nailed we fucking it up. Yeah, I know. It sucks because like time is nail completely invalidates some of the builds. I, I said this before to Lily, but my favorite build is like the Shiv build for Silent. And the boss completely invalidates that build. Oh, you have a Shiv build. Sorry, that's a loss. And screw you. Turn it up and then find weakness. We can heal. Let's go for Zoom. I like the name Zoom. I gotta confess, so I never actually fought, uh, I never actually like beat into heart, I never got that far. The positive chain went to equipment. 
Active item. I don't have an active item, I think. Yeah. I could turn a key into a relic, but uh, is it worth it? You know what? Yeah. Let's do this. Unrecoverable relics. You see five keys. Huh. Well, that's a trade, I guess. A key for five. Okay, I take it. I forgot I have a skill book. Mm, yeah, that's got more. Nah, but this I already have. I don't think it's actually worth it. So let's go for Bloodstorm. Yeah, I know he has already, like, King already has plenty of skills. But him and Azaga are DPS, so they can both have good skills, I think. They're both doing a lot of damage. Okay, I need to keep for this, I don't have a key. Unless, can I use the skeleton one? Nope. Yeah. I'm gonna have to find a display for this. It's alright. There's a fight up there. What else can we find? Ooh, what's this? Nice, we're one gold closer. Sorry. With a hundred gold missing from doing the Colosseum challenge. I don't wonder if the Colosseum can kill us though. I don't think it's... Oh, these are cool. Oh, I love the coffin on his back. I don't know why. I love like characters that use coffins as weapons. Be it like coffins with guns inside of just coffins with aliens inside the guild gear. But so fun. Alright, he has a town, right? They both have towns, so. Um, first we can go to. Okay, basically protect. And high ground. Come on, act up. Approximately 82% of everything I have ever typed in chat have been changed. It's still for people funnier than me. That's what the internet is for. The internet is so big, you go to a forum, you take a good joke, and then you replicate in another place. This is how you get points on the internet. Be it on Twitter, Reddit, whatever. That's how you win. Oh, what's this again? Next door, South Founder. Mm -hmm. Okay, what? I have this. Um, so? I think I screwed up the order of the attacks, but nah, what can we do? It may reduce, but it's fine, they do that more damage, we're doing fine. Oh, now it's doing a lot of damage. Uh, mutilate. Mm, How did that not kill him? Oh, there it goes. <laughs> there it goes. Now it's dead. Oh, but he's so dead. I know what I can do. Ooh. End of the line. And Lucian's word. Easy. There's too much good stuff on the world I have one time but I've seen it all. Trying up to numbers. I got too much personally made a replacement because I have a shit post. But here's the thing, right? You the problem is you're gonna get more personalities if you do this. There's the personality for group one, the personality for Discord 2. You can't keep a single personality for everything, right? Ooh, I like the design of this guy. Mutilate. Has a town, so. Ooh, this is gonna be easy. Choose kills and buffing with. 
going to affect. Ouch. It's alright, we can handle this. Uh, accelerate. This is a good run. I think this... This will be the run. We can actually win this. Unbelievable. No, no, no. Let's keep this. Fantasy? No, pair up. As a whole micro runner, but it always remember your significant other comes second. Your first priority should always be to beat. <laughs> you can't miss a joke, you know. Sometimes, some it's like Thanos said, right? The hardest of choices requires the strongest of wills. Sometimes you gotta you gotta lose a marriage to make a joke. It happens. It's the price you gotta pay. Just look at how many divorced comedians you get fired out around. Um, oh yeah, this. And we're done. Perfect. <laughs> we have sleepers. Oh no. The biggest weapon of Latin America's mothers. The chinelo. La chunka. Heck of plan. Wait, sorry. Mm, yeah, screw this. What the fuck is this? All skills damage to that ring is half removed. Okay, I see. It's alright, it's okay. Divination. I was kind of expecting. Oh, there it is. So. Curse on... I cannot curse anyone else. So maybe... Oh, damage is half. Never mind, I forgot about this. Sheesh! Good boy attack. Nice. Screw it, they're gonna curse you. Three Gushan Swords, two more Gushan Swords, and now... Can we kill her? No, but we're so close. Okay, now we did. <laughs> Be getting any voice because it's funny. We're running the debuff. We don't have. We do have a debuff, but nah, never mind. Screw it. Let's go. Destroy mine. Oh, the pizza started to do damage now, and I am very, very worried. Let's pick fantasy. Ow! Ow, ow, ow! Don't. Ow! They're starting to hurt. They are starting to really hurt me. So. Retribution, fantasy. Nice. Double heal. And I got the illusion sword. Ah, perfect. So now everything purifying barrier. It's gonna remove the it will! Nice, perfect. End of the line. And now I just rotate and there was a gross miscalculation on my part. But I'm sure nothing bad will happen, right? Yeah, hold up. I just didn't fight with this. Oh. It's alright, it's dead. And the wolf has very low HP, so... I just like... 
here. With late so it misses. Dodge, perfect. Fantasy. Zoom. I love the of the attack. Great. Here's the thing, I have a good draw, I have good mana. Let me level up. Yeah, let me get you to four. These people are not playing with fire. Pain, no, 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 I don't want to make a bit of out of pain. So maybe another fire round. And let's waste Crestle too. Kill it! Attack the target and random enemy, success. Oh, it can taunt? That's weird. Excuse any skills. Just can ignore town and track and their pain and within the buff says it freezes. Let's pick this up. Just so she can have an attack, let's take first class to heaven. So she doesn't stay attackless for a long while. Oh, we already have st enough for the Colosseum. Let me just look up and see if we find anything better. A chest? Lifting scroll. I don't have anything cursed, I think. It's okay. And let a bread. That's bread. It actually heals the HP. Nice. Right, but oh, this guy's a little bit scary. Come at me, punks. Accelerate. Accelerate is always good. So, here's what I'm gonna do. Let me rotate this one. And then fire on the ground. Then stack fire on the ground again. It's gonna be Mutilate. Illusion Sword. Curse and protect eh screw it just for the damage for the lows Ooh. holy shit this things do a lot of damage i need double heal oh my gosh and he's stunned wait I know, I know, I know, I know. Let's use consumables. Um. Yeah, there we go. Oh, I can remove CC. Perfect. Now I can. Oh, nice. A little bit of healing. And you attack this guy. Oh no. That was a mistake. No, never mind. That should work. That should work. Everything's doing fine. We are all doing fine. Everything's working according to plan. Uh, he's stunned, right? But it's okay. Oh, look at these things. They're little hedgehogs. They're not hurting me. They're not doing anything. Okay, let me unstun them. No, 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 I know what I'm gonna do. Okay, now, not illusions, we need divine revelation. Shush. Oh, they just heal. It's okay. Never mind then. We can. We think we can take care of this. Yep, I think. Bang. <laughs> Holy shit, so funny. Um, let's go. This is this. <laughs> Ow. That actually hurt, you bastard. Woo! This build so fun. Oh! An unidentified scroll, so let's use. I have two unidentified scrolls. Luckily for us, I have this. 
teleport scroll. Nice. And a scroll that can enchant equipment. Let me enchant the hammer. What the hammer do now? Resist faint. Oh, I see. Now, Hain also has like faint resist. That's actually very good. Lunchbox. Over here, Alex, like five. I think this is good. Can't I sell my items? No? Ah, screw it, let's pick this. The lunchbox. It's an active item that I have to use outside of. Please, I need to activate. Oh no, I see, I see how it works now. Well, I screwed up, but it's okay. I got a bread. Let me heal. Alright, let's face the boss. This is gonna be the last boss for the night, otherwise I'm not gonna... Oh, this is a little bit scary. This is a little bit scary. Uh, word call? At the end of turn, Reaper casts Death Sentence. Prioritizing the owner of the topmost skill. Next turn, the topmost skill's cost reduced by 1. A little bit from a weird description, but... Cost reduced by 1. Okay, I think I understand how it works. Oh, that missed. Can I? Oh, he's taunting. Shit. Okay, what happens if I hold this? Let me see. Oh, when hit by another death sentence. Oh, Alice, you take 36 to damage? Oh, no. No, 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 this cannot. This cannot continue. This guy, please. For the falling. Okay, perfect. Count down one. All right, go ahead. Ooh. Ooh. Holy shit, I forgot about this. How do I... I'm supposed to use it. Oh no. I think we might have reached the end of our run. I clicked the wrong card. I'm fine, I'm okay. Alright. I am okay, I am alright. Everything will work fine. Let me see. There's really not much I can do here. Let me put this here. He's the only one who can survive a hit, otherwise, we are dead. Oof! Okay, let's hope this works. Ouch! Ladies and gentlemen, I think we found our limit. Oh, it's over already! 
Seems we're in a reversible situation again. Well, there's no need to worry. Just accept your fate. This is not the end. Is it is this thing telling me to like give up? You know what? I'm not giving up. I'm gonna go until the end, until we die for real. Screw this. Here we fight into the last second. And it's the last second. <laughs> but okay, if you got actually pretty far. Since so yeah, at least you can try again, right? Oh. What? What is this? What the fuck? I'm sorry? It's a sorry? Wait, wait. I I developed the art project. I investigated as I Oh they're forgetting their memories? It's my son duty to Oh god my ears Ugh. No, never mind. Let's go back. When I open my eyes I'll be back inside the ark. Activate the clock tower. Our mission is to activate the clock tower. That's the only mission. I get... Sorry, I'm getting the feeling that the clock tower is not a good thing now. That I'm not supposed to activate it anymore. Oh, wait. Lucy. Lucy, wake up. Wake up, Lucy! Oh, he's kind of cute, not gonna lie. Are you okay? Can you hear me? Uh, where? Alright, looks like I'm a in time. Where am I? And who are you? Confused, are we? I'm sure you'll come back to your senses to go by Leo. I'm Investigator Azar. Lucy, I was looking for you. Me? You got as far as you can get on the first one. Yeah, thanks to you, Lily. That was so fun. I, I can't believe we got that far. I, I, I think I could have, like, managed that fight if I was a little bit more careful. Unfortunately, brain's empty. That happens. Guess it's gotta be expected. I was... Oh. Ugh. I should... Have we met before? No, I don't believe we met before. I feel like you're familiar. It's like, oh, did I skip? Anyway, Lucy, are you hurt anywhere? Huh? Not really. I'm fine. Thank goodness. If you get hurt, we have no chance to activate the clock tower. Clock tower. Oh god, I remember it. Out of bad dragons, alright? That's right, I need to go to the clock tower. As soon as I can. I need to activate the clock tower. That's my destiny. Yeah, alright, I can feel the determination. We reached the end, sure it's time. <laughs> yeah, for sure we reached the end. Ah, sorry, it's nothing. Let's get out of here. This place dangerous. We should head back to the Ark now. Over there, the floating island. That's the Ark. Your destination of the clock tower is also there. We can't activate the clock tower just yet, but I will spend things once more once we get there. Come on, let's go, follow me. Woo! This is nice. Here we are. Yeah, that's the city that I've seen before starting the run.
Welcome to the art, Lucy. So this is the art. Yes, the only safe heaven left in this world. This place is the residential area. It's kind of a relaxing place. It almost feels like you've been here before. This is where you'll be staying from now on. I'll be looking forward to working with you, Lucy. Azar, you said you were searching for me, right? Why did you search for me? Why I searched for you? That's because you're the girl of the prophecy who will save this world. Girl of prophecy? That's right, you're the chosen one. You're the hero of prophecy that will pass down the arc for generations. With your power, we can activate the clock tower and restore the world with former glory. My power? All you can do is repeat what I say. Yeah, you do remember when I said that we can't activate the clock tower just yet. We need a set of material to know us the time shades. Time shades. The time shades, as I said before, are scattered across the twisted land as fragments, but the girl of prophecy has the ability to locate the time shades. I see. The twisted land is always shifting, so it's impossible to find the shades through normal methods. However, with the girl of prophecy on our side, it's a completely different story. So the first step is to search for the time shades. Yeah, exciting, don't you think? I want to start the investigation right away, but... It's already late for today, so let's get to bed and rest. Okay. I prepared a room for you, so you can rest there. See you tomorrow, Lucy. Oh, so this is where we're gonna start our runs. I get it. Aww, it's sleepy. Oh? Alright, I see. There seems to be a lot of stuff that I can... I can mess around now. Should I rest for a while? Yeah, let's rest. And I think... Oh. This is... A little bit scary, not gonna lie. I like the vibes of this game. I really like them, not gonna lie. So, I think I gotta stop here for now because it's already pretty late and I have to go make dinner, yes, so <laughs> it's gonna be a little bit of a rush here. But thank you for watching, I had a lot of fun in this game. I did not expect it to be like that, honestly. It was so fun to go blind into this. Thanks to Lily, I got pretty far. Managed to go up to, like, the Reaper, so to speak. So I'm sure I'm gonna be playing this game again. I'm not sure if I will be able to, like, wait until... Wait until I can stream it again to play it. But we'll see, I'm gonna keep you all updated. Anyway, thank you for watching. I hope you all have a good time. And I... From what I've seen, Joey is streaming Shooting Dragoon. In this case, let me see. Where is Shooting Dragoon? Did I name it right? I did. Perfect. Anyway, thank you for showing up. I hope you all have a great time. And I hope to see you next time. Bye! Oh, forgot the button. Bye!